So the, in this video we will be talking about the difference between HPLC and FPLC. The reason why I use these techniques over here mm -hmm. um, is because 2D polychromite gel electrophoresis abbreviated as 2D page only sorts proteins or samples by first charge and then pH, but only in the pH region between 4 to 10 pH units. HPLC and FPLC stand for HPLC being high performance liquid chromatography and it only uses organic phase analysis via organic solvents, whereas um, FPLC uses um, aqueous phase solvents and is um, the acronym for fast performance liquid chromatography. So these techniques, HPLC is used primarily to analyze hydrophobic amino acid sequences, whereas FPLC is used primarily to analyze hydrophilic amino acid sequences. This is because when you put the amino acid sequence in its natural conformation and put it in a hydrophobic environment, the hydrophobic residues indicated here in green are towards the outside where they interact with the environment, whereas the hydrophilic core is away from the hydrophobic environment inside the um, hydrophilic moiety at the center of the 3D molecule. Conversely, in a hydrophilic environment, the hydrophilic residues of the overall amino acid sequence indicated in these pictures by the blue in the primary sequence are towards the outside of the 3D conformation in the native environment. Thus, you need to break down into two different analysis techniques, HPLC and FPLC, and do a case analysis for the organic phase primarily versus the aqueous phase primarily. Any questions? Um, so after you run the HPLC or the FPLC, mm -hmm. what, what comes next? Can you like run a blast since you have the amino acid sequence? Find out on the next episode of Shelby Cooper's <laughs> Pest Review.